begin by putting 50 milliliters of methanol into the uh, into an Erlenmeyer flask with a uh, glass wool frit um, <clears throat> inside of a um, broken off or inside of a uh, <laughs> I don't know how to describe this. This is a glass uh, pipette that we've broken the tip off and uh, made it into a sort of filter uh, kind of with a glass wool in the middle of it. So now we'll take our um, and we'll uh, get that uh, stirring water form of vortex. We'll then uh, slowly pipe that our um, polystyrene mixture into the uh, glass um, filter system. Go to add this strip wise, you can see that we immediately form a precipitate. We want to make, make sure we have at least an inch of head space above our um, frit. So don't add this too fast. And if we need to, we can take a We'll pipe that here and squeeze this through. This is the part of the lab I can't wait for. <laughs> All right, so now we're going to decant our uh, solution that you've previously seen us uh, drip our polystyrene into. Um, we want to, um, you'll be, you can definitely see there's a, a sort of larger precipitate on the uh, bottom that is our desired product and the sort of floating, um, the sort of larger uh, product is, our, is what, what's desired and the sort of um, scattering uh, stuff that's making the solution white is not really a desired product. So we're going to decant off this methanol. Obviously we just want to try to get as much of the liquid out without getting any of our solid product. I'm going to take this um, Magnet, place it on the bottom here, it's, uh, up so I don't uh, lose our skirt. That's good enough, don't you? <laughs>